Today I have a message for Gearbox in 2K, one I think we all will agree on. Please add the new legendaries into the loot pool when we unlock them via collecting the hearts. To be honest guys, that about sums up the video, you don't really have to stay past this point if you don't want to. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and today I bring another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you want to see more. On screen now you can see my weekly giveaway along with last week's winner. To be in the chance of winning this yourself, follow the instructions on screen now and good luck. So with the Broken Hearts Day event, we got legendary weapons via shooting 50 and 100 hearts, which I feel haven't in reality been incorporated right. The two legendaries I am talking about are the Polyamorous SMG and the Wedding Invitation Sniper Rifle, unlocked at you shooting 50 and 100 hearts. Problem is guys, at the moment it's believed you can only get one of these per Vault Hunter you use. Upon you getting them from the challenge of uh, collecting 100 hearts, you can't get them again. There's no way you can farm these for decent rolls, which in my opinion is a massive mistake on Gearbox's part. Upon us unlocking these, they should be added into the loot pool. To be honest, I thought they would have been added into the loot pool of the gold hearts, which do drop loot. Why ain't they? I don't understand. As you can see, my version of the poly is a 92 moles, a vote hunter I don't play. My wedding invitation is better, but it still isn't the one I would choose, or chase for, or farm for. Now I'm sure someone at Gearbox will get the message if we shout loud enough and hopefully these new legendaries will be added into the loot pool before this event ends. This event is only a week long by the way so there isn't much time. And yes I feel it's an amazing addition to add back the bloody Harvey salute via the ghost hearts which spawn loot ghosts. They are a very welcome addition. But the point of us in reality if you haven't got more than a single vault hunter only getting one chance to get these two new legendaries I feel that was a mistake. So please Gearbox, please 2k, give us the chance of somehow being able to farm these two new legendaries, new to the Broken Hearts Day weekly event. If you agree with this, hit that like button, as the wider the audience this reaches, the more likely it will happen. On that note, we have come to the end of the video, people. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. If you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. And hopefully, people, I will see you on that next one.